Hey folks, this is Jake Davis with an on-the-fly review for you, and today I'm talking about, um, uh, Four Good Days, uh, released earlier in the year, uh, directed by Rodrigo Garcia, starring Mila Kunis, uh, Glenn Close, and Steven Root. It's actually, actually a really good movie, to be honest with you. Um, uh, usually you don't tend to lean towards the metal dramas or films about uh, drug addiction. But I did very, very much enjoy this film. I liked uh, Close and Kunis' performances. Um, uh, the whole concept of this movie is Mila Kunis is uh, a severe uh, heroin addict who uh, can't, who uh, who's, who's volunteering for this experimental drug that they inject you with that will basically su suppress your 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 needs for uh, drug use and stuff like that. But you have to have be completely drug clean for at least uh, uh, 96 hours, something like that. You know, four good days. You gotta have four good days in you or under your belt before you could uh, take this drug. And the movie is basically about her spending those four days with her her mother and her stepfather, and not only going into the depth of her own addiction, but also the problems with with her mother and the way that this uh, an addiction the addiction really affects everybody in your life. You know your your parents, your siblings, your uh, children. And it's just, uh, I mean, I don't want to say it's profound because it's not telling me anything about drugs that I, that I haven't learned, uh, <laughs> I haven't learned the hard way. <laughs> I mean, well, well, I do, I think this movie hit kind of a really good balance of reality and trying to tell a good story. Um, and as far as Mila Kunis playing a heroin addict, it's like, you know, <laughs> I mean, she's literally one of the most beautiful people alive. <laughs> as far as, it's, I mean, even her with makeup trying to look like she has a severe drug problem, it's just, she's just so pretty. She's so pretty. <laughs> but I'm going to give this movie four stars because I thought it, it did, it really, it did. They did a really good job. And Mila and Glenn are both really, really terrific in it. And like I said, the, the, the very, very human element and human factor of self-loathing, self-blame, and even, you know, self-betterment. It's, it's, it's a positive and encouraging story. And I do want to say that, you know, If, if you have somebody in your life who you know that is going through a severe drug problem, there's two things I can tell you from experience. is One, you can't help a person who's not willing to help himself. And two, you cannot give up on someone you love. That's all there is to it. And I know what hurts. And I know it is some of the most painful, traumatic things a lot of people will ever experience in their lives. But you got to be there for the people you care about. You have to. They need you. Anyhow, I... I guess I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, uh, ultimately, I'm going to give the movie four and a half stars. Uh, four stars. Uh, it's a good movie. Very good movie with strong performances and a very positive, realistic message. Uh, 